I started Seesaw in 2003. We've done studies that shows that Seesaw drew students to cybersecurity because of Seesaw suddenly they got exposed to cybersecurity and they chose cybersecurity as a career. I think Seesaw is a tremendous opportunity for students across the country and across the world um, and also bringing together professionals to, for them to learn from and professionals to network. A lot of the challenges are mimic of a real world situation so if there is a vulnerability out there that's been discovered somebody will probably write a challenge for it to kind of simulate that same environment and so it helps the student to learn how to, do, to, to find those things and how to attack those things and how the hackers will actually go after them as well. When I heard about the competition, I was like, what does it even mean to capture the flag? So yeah, my friends told me about it and then I liked it. I just slowly, slowly improved. I just got into it by starting out with like some really basic CTFs, like the high school ones. You need a bit of experience before you can even like go in the qualifiers because you'll won't solve that many problems. This year I decided to enter HSF because I want to try cybersecurity related challenges in addition to uh, programming challenges. And I decided to create this team because Sophia and I um, met at that team and we are just like, we like solving problems together. I guess it will mean a lot to certain people to have an all girls team in a competition because I know it would have meant a lot to me to have more representation in the places I was going to, like in the math competitions I went to, or in any of the programming classes I wanted to sign up for. It's, it's cool that they do the law and policy competition because I think it bridges a gap um, that otherwise, you know, I think tech people and policy people or lawyers can sometimes miss that everything's multidisciplinary and it's important to think about all of these issues in tandem, not just on their own. Facebook comes pretty much every year to the Seesaw Career Fair. One of the things that we uh, really like about coming is that all the students that come around are usually uh, passionate about cybersecurity and protecting people. Just kind of all of these services and technologies against adversary stuff. That's kind of one of the biggest uh, things that we like about Seesaw. So when I went to uh, Seesaw uh, as a CTF competitor. I was a CTF finalist. And uh, one of the things that happened was I actually got recruited by Facebook at Seesaw. But this is probably the best day I had in a long time. Uh, so I, I'll, I learned a lot about the young people, young talent. I hope they learned a lot about TD. Uh, and I just hope that they're going to consider to work for TD Bank. Well, there are multiple reasons that a company may sponsor Seesaw. One is just for philanthropy, that this is a good cause. We all know that the country needs many more cybersecurity professionals. The second reason could be branding. They know that some of the best talent is here. And then some may sponsor simply because we help them address a specific problem. We incorporate it into a challenge and that allows them to get insights, get some very talented people, look at the problem and, and come up with some novel ways of approaching it. And that is of, sometimes of value to companies as well. I think it's really important to support and build outreaches and initiatives like Seesaw. So um, Capsulate is a proud sponsor of Seesaw and um, we'd like to see more people helping out as well.